Hello everyone, this is me, Sadia here, and I'm back with the first week of June reads from the 1st through the 7th of June 2023. This reading is going to be for the sign of Cancer. So Cancer, let's see what is coming up for you for the first week of uh, June time. I will be adding oracle cards and a lot more in this reading, so stay tuned on the Friday dive into the read. Let me remind you, it's a general read, it may not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonates and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID. In the description box, you can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. We have our first card, which is for fans. Um, I really see you having a lot of fun times with uh, with your friends and family in, uh, in the very first week of uh, June. I really feel like, you know, for some of you... Um, unexpected um, situation is going to develop where you will have a chance to um, get to know someone get engaged to someone get married to someone and I really feel like you know this person the situation is not somebody from the past I really feel like you know it's gonna be somebody new um, it can come as a proposal it can come as a as a uh, as your friends kind of like you know get to you or uh, meet someone new maybe a uh, you know a mutual friend or something uh, which might turn into something um, amazing in the very first go so I really feel like you know something unexpected developing in your love life especially uh, is what I'm picking up um, and you will be spending a lot of quality time with your friends and family and I really feel like you know that quality time that you're gonna be having for some of you you might have traveled to uh to to be in a family gathering or something for others of you you might be invited in some sort of family gathering as well which which uh, which would turn out to be the most loving moment of your life where you are going to meet your life partner so i really see you know for majority of you who have felt that your love life was stuck or stagnant i really see that unexpected meeting is going to come through which is going to move your life from where it has been since forever to something beautiful and abundant and i really see the quick movement ahead for you and i really feel like you know for majority of you you're done and tired of being on the waiting side of something good to come through for your love life uh you might have uh, talked about it to your friends and family as well that you really want to move forward with your love life but you have nobody to to move on with or something like that and then comes this uh, opportunity where you meet someone in a gathering and that's when everything is going to change so i really see that for some of you, you might be getting engaged or committed to this person instantly um and when i say instantly it doesn't mean like you know there and then but it's it's going to be like so quick that it would feel almost like instant i would say so i really see that um unexpected meet up with someone is going to change things in your love life so let's see more cards here what else is coming in for you in the first week of june time <clears throat> for some of you it could be a farewell party of someone as well maybe one of your colleague is going out and uh, maybe you are you guys are giving a farewell party to that person and that's where you meet this person so it, it can be like um like not something that you were put on a blind date with someone it could be a group of gath you know gathering of a group of people i would say uh, where you're going to have a chance to meet this person, family gathering, colleagues gathering, or something like that. But I really see things changing quickly between you and this person, um, where where the two of you would probably take things next level, uh, commit to each other, or get engaged to each other unexpectedly so quick. Uh, we do have Five of Pentacles, the Empress, um, Ten of Swords, and the helmet under in the deck we do have the knight of cups i really feel like you know you have always felt like you know why i'm left out why my love life is not going anywhere you have waited waited waiting for things to work out maybe with a specific someone uh but that connection that you were waiting for maybe that has ended badly in recent times um and then you were like you know still hopeful but you never saw anything coming towards you and i really feel like you know this week is going to be so unexpected uh, you know, the way it is going to bring you a lot of, uh, you know, changes, uh, you know, in your life. I really feel like, you know, you are, you have no clue what's coming up for you. You have no idea how is it going to happen. Maybe you are not planning even to be with the, you know, to be going out with, uh, on some, on some uh, you know, uh, gathering right now. Uh, but something is going to happen unexpectedly, unplanned 
that that is going to um you know get you the surprise of your life and you're gonna meet this person and you're gonna get like you know um have that connect with this person which is going to make you feel like you can definitely move on with this person you can move forward with this person i really feel like you know for majority of you you um you have been having uh, some weird dreams as well uh, when it comes to your love life lately. Um, maybe you have been seeing someone from the past. Maybe you have been seeing someone new. But you have been having weird dreams when it comes to your love life. I really feel like you know, if you have, I really feel like you know, it's a sign that this reading is going to resonate with you more than others. Um, and I really see that this offer that is coming in, it's, it's like, you know, you have a lot of going on you know, negativity going on in your mind about your love life right now. And thinking of one thing which is going to turn out to be positive is, is something very alien to you right now because you really don't see it coming. And I really see it to be unexpected because you probably don't have any hope around it. Maybe you don't feel like, you know, you have the right kind of people who you know and then, you know, how can you meet someone who is going to be exactly how you want your person to be? Um maybe you are going to feel like not willing to go to this invitation at first place thinking like you know what am i going to do there and you know you have no idea how the universe has planned everything perfectly and you know things that were stuck in your life for years i feel like you know it's time for them to move forward so um let's see what else is coming in for you in your life in the first week of june time What else is coming in for you in your life in the first week of June? What else is coming in for you in the first week of June? So we have four cards here. Nine of emotions. This is a magical time in your life when wishes are granted and dreams come true. It may seem that good luck is following you, but actually these happy times are just a reward for being a loving and wonderful person. Your angels are asking you to enjoy your life and have more fun. So beautiful energies are being rewarded. Like, you know, I really feel like, you know, um, you deserve this beautiful energy that is coming up for you. You know, this might seem magical. This might seem perfect. This might seem um you know why how and why i'm getting all of this but yes you deserve it um your hard work and sincere efforts lead to a sense of safety contentment and financial security you deserve to take a break and enjoy the magnificent life that you have created it may be a time to celebrate a wonderful event such as an engagement a wedding buying a new home or a birth of a child so again for some of you probably you would be invited in one of the gatherings where you are going to meet the one uh, or maybe it is going to be your own engagement or gathering of people because uh, maybe you are getting engaged to someone. Maybe you have been, uh, you know, or you have met this person already and it is going to be a time when you are going to be like living your dream life with this person. Um, there are great rewards in spending time alone. Use those moments of solitude to focus on love, ways in which you might give to those around you. Shine your light as an example for others to follow. Seek out a spiritual mentor if your own uh of your own if your life feels unfulfilled right now now for those of you who are still struggling with 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 life in general or love life in particular i really feel like it's time for you to know that you know being alone or being single is not a bad thing you can use this time to create the life that you desire and you have no clue about it so it's time for you to have a mentor who can help you understand the the value and worth of being alone because it can make you the magical being that you can become by spending time alone with yourself and bettering yourself up in so many varied ways uh which can which can make you the genie yourself like you know who can bring um anything that you want like you know it's it's, it's a, such a a powerful uh, time of one's life if you start using it in the right way forward so i really feel like you know the divine really wants you to work on that instead of complaining instead of feeling lost and lonely it's time for you to work on that um heaven has provided so many blessings your family members are bonded and working together the children are provided for and a very comfortable retirement will one day come along you have taught your family the grace that comes from knowing right from wrong and you should be very proud. I really see you moving forward towards having a family life with this card here. I really feel like, you know, for a majority of you, you are you are now there where you know that everything is going to work out so well for you. Because you're feeling very confident and happy from within. Having the perfect life partner probably. Having that perfect 
home life probably and you know that everything is going to pan out so beautiful um let's see one last card of the read let's see what else is coming in for you and this week time what else is coming in for you for this week time journey a new journey that you're going to embark this week time I really feel like you know it's gonna be a very beautiful one. You are gonna feel very light and heart, light, light-hearted and positive. Uh, there's a lot of uh, you know uh, growth within this you know journey that you're gonna be having or starting. I really see it to be a beautiful journey. For for majority of you, I really don't like I said earlier in many times. I really don't see you having this coming for you. I really don't think that you even expect it to happen. And then. Um, you are going to be surprised definitely with the with everything that is coming up for you during this uh, uh week time it's it's just going to be a magical magical surprise for you uh to have to have someone in your life coming uh you know this week time is is nothing less than a miracle so yeah that's pretty much it coming up for you for this week time if it was of help do like share and subscribe till i do the next read for you guys take care bye